to my channel. Today we're going to be talking about something super interesting, or at least I think it is, and that is natural remedies. In case you don't know what a natural remedy is, it's basically just like a concoction of some sort, mixing natural ingredients that come like straight from nature, and they are used to treat a problem that you might have. Just very recently, I found this brand called Isabella's Clearly on Instagram. Going through their online store, I saw that they had a lot, a lot of products that I was actually interested in. As you know, I don't like to use ingredients that can be harmful to your health and the environment. And so using natural remedies, you're basically just using stuff from nature. So you don't have to worry about um, harming the environment or harming your health or your body. So that's something that I always tell people like why I do like using natural remedies. And yeah, I mean, they can call me hippie and I don't care. I mean, yeah, I'm basically a hippie, you can, yeah. And so after talking to them, they were very interesting in sending me some products for me to share with you guys. And so I decided on three. The thing with natural remedies is also that because it's natural ingredients, it takes longer for you to see the results. But I have told you um, I've used many natural remedies in the past and they have always worked. Sometimes uh, ones take longer than others, but they always seem to work. That's why I was so happy to find Isabella's Clearly because they have just the most amazing range of products. They have a lot of products for taking care of your hair and your scalp your skin whether it's on your face or your body in general they have balms they have like whitening uh powders for your teeth um they just have just like a really like amazing range so if you're interested um i'm gonna leave you the website of course on the description so you can check them out but let me show you the products that i got and I'll talk a little bit of how I've been using them and how fast I've been seeing the results and all of that. Okay, these are the products. A lash serum, a um, hair mask. Well, uh, it's more of a skull uh, mask. In this oil treatment for varicose and spider veins. I'll talk about the lash uh, serum first. I have, for many, many years, I have been taking care of my lashes. I was feeling that although um, they are on the longer side, they didn't look full enough. And so I was trying to focus on get them to grow um, and grow stronger as well. And I just couldn't do it by myself. So that's why I was very interested when I first tried this. I forgot that natural remedies take a little bit long for you to start seeing the actual results. So at first I was just like, oh, I think it's not working, but I'm gonna keep on using it because I really like that it comes with the spoolie and it's just easier to apply. But now after I think it's, I'm going to say it's like two and a half or three weeks, when I start putting mascara, I was like, my lashes look way longer and they look fuller, but I couldn't really pinpoint. I couldn't remember that I was using the lash serum until I was talking to my mom and she asked me like, hey, how's it going with the lash serum? And I was like, oh, that's why. So yeah, basically now like paying attention to it, I'm seeing that my lashes are longer, but I'm also seeing lots of new little lashes like growing and popping out. So that's very interesting. So I'm really, really liking that. And also I have to say that I have been using it on my brows. I didn't have that many hairs in there to begin with. And then I was in like junior high or something and I ruined them. And now it's been years. I have been trying to get them to grow back. And after using this one nightly as well for two and a half or three weeks, I start seeing like much, much more hairs. Um, they were much thicker. And I've also been growing hairs like really close to like my lid. And I didn't have that problem before. Like I used to pluck my eyebrows maybe like once every three months. And I just had like one or two very noticeable hairs. And right now, 
basically my eyebrows have never been hairier <laughs> they look like a forest to me so the serum has been really helping them and um, as you can see in the close-up I have like a lot of little hairs growing and I'm just so delighted with that like I feel a little bit more confident that you can really see my eyebrows whereas before you couldn't really tell that they were there to be honest like they were that bad the next product is the scalp mask I asked them for something because I was having a lot a lot of dandruff and I know that has a lot to do with um, the water because since we moved here um, that's when I noticed it so I was interested in a mask that could help me deal with that problem but I know also that I have to change the filter on the shower head because the water here is pretty hard so this one I've been using once a week and it says to leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes and that's what I did the first time the second time that I did it it was on a weekend and so I put it on in the morning and I totally forgot that I had it on until like about an hour or an hour and a half later and that's when I just took a shower immediately that second time I really saw a difference and I don't know if it was because I left it uh, for a longer period but um, now that's what I've been doing I like to do it on the weekend so I put the mask um, when I first wake up we have breakfast and all of that and then when I shower it's been maybe like an hour or two I pump it directly on my skull and maybe I do like one here and then I do another one here and another one here which is where I have like the most um, problems I like to massage it with my fingers um, to make sure that I spread it around the area that I want to um, deal with and that's how I've been seeing um, the results right now i still have a little bit of um, dandruff but i know i'm telling you i know it's also because of the shower filter also when rinsing it i know um, when we do like hair masks you tend to really try to focus on getting rid of the oil because if not even after you shampoo and rinse and everything your hair is still oily i haven't had this problem with um, this uh, mask even though it's pretty oily but I haven't had any problems, just I do my regular shampoo, I do the same time um, as any other day and I have no problems, my hair is not greasy or anything at the end and that's something that's also like a big plus that you don't have to take like extra time to make sure you rinse it off and also I know it's not its purpose but I have been using it um, as a hair oil every time I wash my hair which is like two or three times a week and my hair has been feeling really really soft I know it's not its purpose but it has tons of good stuff in here so that's why I was like I'm just gonna give it a try and see how it works and it works really good I'll give you just a little bit of the ingredients it has um, jojoba oil, cedarwood, basil, lavender manuka clary sage rosemary tea tree so again it's all good stuff and i feel like my hair really likes it and it feels crazy soft once i let it air dry it feels really really soft and i do like that i appreciate that soft hair okay and now let's talk about the varicose and spider veins um oil okay so this one I have been using for the same amount of time and I've been trying to use it every morning at and night and I have been using it mainly to deal with some varicose veins and some tiny spider veins that I have here and there and I still haven't seen much of a difference yet I do two pumps every time and I still have quite a lot of um, the product so of course I'm gonna keep on using it again I know natural remedies need to take their time to be effective so i want to be consistent and keep on applying it and i know this problem might be a little bit harder to deal with because it's something with like your blood circulation and all of that so i'm gonna look further into that because maybe i need to be doing something else and i have to say some of the veins might not even be varicose 
my skin is very see-through and you can see like almost every vein on my on my body i don't know why not even even if i get tan you can still see them i get i i don't know if my skin is like very thin i don't know and there's a couple of uh veins that i remember having on my legs like being noticeable since i was little so i'm not sure that um that is considered a varicose vein but i'm just trying to i'm using the oils to see if um that's gonna help some but um i'm not too concerned i mean i just want to make sure that they're not gonna turn into a problem and they're gonna be painful later and yeah i'm just trying to be proactive and just a little note i do like to go like this every night if i can remember but i do like to read a little bit or be on my phone um just uh, and leave my my legs up for about 15 to 20 minutes to help with circulation and i know this can help too so i've been doing it along with this one so i'm gonna give it oof, my hair. i'm gonna give it more time and i'm gonna update you guys so as i told you in the beginning i won't be discouraged i know natural remedies need time to work and so i'm not worried um i just know that they need time and that's what i'm gonna give them it doesn't take more than a minute um in the morning and a minute or not at night and actually it feels kind of nice i bring it um to my bedside table at night and um before i lay down before i raise my legs i like to go over um, them with um, the oil and so it feels like kind of like a little massage and i mean you don't have to i'm watching tv doing the little massage and then i raise my legs and it feels very nice i haven't had any struggles on it being super greasy i usually put it in the morning after my shower and my body oil my regular like full body oil i put it on and it absorbs really really quickly also um i haven't noticed any problems at night even though like my pores aren't as open as after a shower i don't have any problems i don't feel like the sheets are just like sticking to my legs i don't have any of those problems and i haven't seen any oil spots on the sheets so if that's one of your concerns you don't have to worry about it and i'll give you some of the ingredients of the vein treatment and what do we have here it's horse chestnut which i've read in many places that it's really good for like varicose veins um helichrysum i don't know if that's how you say it um basil grapefruit fennel juniper berry um and rosemary so um these are just some of the ingredients again i'm not worried because i know that no matter if i keep on using it it won't have any side effects i'm not harming my body and or my health in any way and just to give you like a few final thoughts about Isabella's Clearly, the products that I have been using have been amazing. I do like the quality of the ingredients and the prices are very affordable. I know some people like to do their own natural remedies, but for me that right now I just don't have the time to do the research and make sure that I get like the right quality ingredients for them to be effective. Um, I just love that they have all these products to help with different problems. You don't have to worry about them having like funky ingredients that you don't know what they are or how to spell. Um, they don't use any fillers. There's just only good and effective ingredients for whatever um, problem you want to deal with. I've seen they sell them on Amazon. I don't know if all the products, but they sell some there. But I've also just checked their website and right now you get free shipping and a gift with every $25 uh, purchase. I already have my eye on a few other products and I'm gonna be purchasing them soon. And you know what? I'm probably gonna make a little review as well so that I can encourage you guys to try them as well. Because um, yeah, it's a really good company. If you have any questions about the products or the brand, please let me know in the comments. That's it. I'm going to be wrapping this video up. I hope you liked it and please let me know if there's any other products that you're interested um, to see or for me to explore. And as always, I have a blog post prepared 
with the information that I just gave you. Please make sure to check that out and I'm gonna leave uh, the links on the description and the links to the products. I love trying natural remedies so please make sure if there's something that you want me to try it let me know and I guess I'll see you next week. Please, if you could like this video, send it to a friend, share it with your family, on your social media, subscribe. If you could please do that, I would be so deeply grateful. I'm more than happy to share this information with you guys because I feel like you guys are my friends and I always like to help my friends and just tell them about the new things that I discovered, about the new brands and products that I discovered. So that's the way I'm looking at this. It's just me being a good friend and sharing the stuff with you so yeah i hope to see you next wednesday here on my youtube channel because i love to help you guys i'll see you next time bye